Hey there, it's Tuesday. It's the 21st of December. The winter solstice will officially welcome the new season just before 9 a.m. Colorado time. And right around that same time is when a red flag warning goes into effect for the foothills west of Denver. This is the higher terrain of Jefferson Boulder and Lamar counties. Although in Lamar, it does extend all the way out into Fort Collins. It goes over into northern Weld County as well. The concern up north is really up here on the Cheyenne Ridge, just north of Fort Collins. And then the uh, higher terrain west of Colorado Springs, Pueblo, Walsenburg down here in southern Colorado. All those areas under a red flag warning as well. Wind gusts up to 65 miles per hour, relative humidity under 15% combined with the dry soil and the mild temperatures today means if a fire were to start in any of those areas, it could spread rapidly. High temperatures today will be up near 60 degrees in Denver. That's about 15 to 20 degrees above normal, depending on your specific neighborhood. It does stay much colder on Colorado's western slope. Same thing for tomorrow. Highs in the lower 60s here in Denver. Similar weather pattern coming up on Thursday. But also on Thursday, we're going to see snow spread across our mountains from a storm system that's still about 2,000 miles northwest of Colorado. It's up near Juneau, Alaska here early in the day on Tuesday. That system's going to sink southward initially, make its way down the west coast, bringing California lots of rain and snow. And the moisture from this system is going to wrap around the south side and then make its way up into Colorado. This is not a favorable pattern for us to get any moisture here in the metro area. But it's a great pattern for us to see quite a bit of mountain snow, especially in the San Juans. That's where the highest amounts will be. Probably be over a foot for some mountain areas down that way. We'll watch for that in the uh, Gore Range, Central Mountains as well. Farther north, not as much, but we could still get a half a foot up around Steamboat. Notice what we do not have on this snow forecast is anything to the east of the mountains. It's just the downslope flow is going to work so hard to keep us dry. And so we're going to keep it dry in Denver at this point, other than a small chance for rain. And you know, the chance for a white Christmas in Denver is probably lower than you actually think. It's 37 percent. That's the historical probability of at least one inch of snow on the ground in Denver on Christmas Day. This year, the chance for a white Christmas is near zero, whereas in our high country, it's near 100%. So if you want a winter wonderland, it won't be far away. Here in Denver, the chance for any rain Thursday night and Friday morning is about 30%. It's possible there could be a few snowflakes mixed in Friday morning as well. And then it looks clear and dry for Friday night into Saturday. Saturday's high 54, Sunday up to 56. It looks colder for next week, but nothing unusual for this time of year.